Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here and it is wet and rainy here, but yeah, the rain has gone away a lot. So yeah, come to this lovely, lovely nature place, which I filmed at the other day. One of my favorite places to come to. And yeah, I didn't plan a video, but I thought I'd come here and make one. And what I thought I'd talk about is me now being back on one meal a day since yesterday after making the video of me talking about the pros and cons of switching to two meals a day and comparing it to one meal a day if you haven't seen that video i put a link for it up above but yeah when i made that video and i was actually listening to myself share with you all of everything on that subject that i've just mentioned that there's way more cons to pros with actually eating two meals a day and how I so way more prefer eating one meal a day. And it seemed after making that video that I just naturally went to eating one meal a day that day because I was just feeling really, really good from it. I found that I wasn't going into any intense stress response because I did mention in the video when I quit one meal a day that I was going into too much of a stress response, it was having a negative effect on me and that my energy levels were really good. I trained for around two hours, which is longer than I normally train. And yeah, I was just functioning optimally in my mind and body holistically. And I was so happy to eat one meal a day because I was like, yes, I've got to be way more productive and do so much more of what I love to do in my day and focus way less upon eating food and going out and getting food at restaurants and other different places. So yeah, it was a very, very positive experience. And it seems that my body today wants to eat one meal a day. I'm now around 21 hours into fasting. It's around half two in the afternoon. Feeling absolutely amazing. This is why I'm out making the video. We've just done a lot of yoga at our gym and it was really, really good. Janessa helped me do some partner stretching as well. And yeah, for me, I absolutely love doing yoga. It's so good for my mind and body holistically. Afterwards, I feel like I have smoked something that I used to years ago that just relaxes you a lot, but without any negative side effects and without putting anything toxic in the body as well. So back to the topic of a hand, because I noticed that I'm going off in a bit of a different direction. And yeah, it just feels right for me to be eating one meal a day. It felt really, really good. I'm just really happy to be back on it. Whether I'm gonna to continue to do it every day is another thing. What I've learned is I just need to listen to my body every single day and just do what it wants me to do. And yeah, definitely not gonna go back to three meals a day. Two meals a day is very, very easy. One meal a day, yeah, you obviously sometimes, it can be harder. But as long as you know what you're doing, you can make it work for you. But if I notice that my body starts going into too much of a stress response whilst going into the deeper fasted state, because that's what I was finding sometimes, and well, quite a few times, and that's the main reason why I stopped doing one more day, my body was going into too much of a stress response, and it's having a negative effect on me. I'm not necessarily going to put it down to eat one meal a day. What was happening around that time period was I was working way, way more, spending loads of hours more additional on editing videos and producing videos, a lot more time around electronic devices. And yeah, I was just having more stress in my life than I normally would have done. But now I feel with eating two meals a day, and just reducing my stress and not doing as much that my body has fully healed. So I believe that's one of the main reasons why I'm able to go back to eating one meal a day. And yeah, we end up just seeing a friend then. So this is why I paused for a while and why I've now not got a top on because it got really, really hot. And yeah, we're around 23 hours now into fasting and I still feel really, really amazing. Haven't really got any hunger there or it's just, well, should I say it's just very, very minimal just some grinning going on that makes you feel hungry, but it will pass in a very short while. But it's nothing that makes you think, oh wow, I need to eat. So yeah, I will keep you updated on this journey. And also I feel another factor that has been making me feel way better since eating two meals a day, it's helped me go in the direction of going back to one meal a day, is I'm eating a lot more fat in my diet in the form of durian, which is known as the world's smelliest fruit so I would continue to consume a lot of that every single day and I had it to break my fast yesterday and then we went out and ate restaurant food 
So yeah, I'll continue doing that and just monitor how I'm feeling. But yeah, I just don't know how people eat multiple meals a day. It's a huge inconvenience for me, but I guess a lot of people are not producers, so to speak, they're more consumers and they're not trying to achieve so much in the world like I am to, well, like I am doing every single day. So yeah, anything that I can do to make me save a lot of time and get me to work more on the things that I want to achieve in the world so I can help more people and leave my legacy behind, I am going to do it. So for me, one meal a day is just as, well, it's just the most suitable diet out there for me and I will continue to eat a plant-based vegan diet because it makes for the best and we'll be making a video soon talking about why I eat a vegan diet and have done for around five years. And something I noticed with training yesterday, where I trained for around two hours, I was able to train for longer and really, really hard and have more stamina, strength and endurance and recover a lot quicker today as well. And I had something that messed up my sleep last night so I haven't slept as well but it is just making me feel way better. And obviously the main reason is it gives you greater hormonal production benefits. It's allowing your digestive system to rest for a lot longer because it's not digesting multiple meals throughout the day. So yeah, it just feels completely right for me to be eating one meal a day. But yeah, who knows? Maybe it will start to go down here again. But yeah, I'll do everything in my power to make it feel the best for me whilst in that intermittent fasting state on the one meal a day diet journey. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below. If you like the video, like it down below. Don't forget to share this video with other people that you think may want to hear about me back on one meal a day and why I'm absolutely loving it and just what's going on with me and my current intermittent fasting diet. And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis. And the videos you can expect to get from me if you subscribe are one meal a day, informational videos, what I eat in a day and do in a day videos, calisthenics, workout and progression videos, and all different types of videos to help you go in the direction of gaining and maintaining the body desire, the fitness levels and the energy levels as well. So if those types of videos sound good to you, make sure you click that subscribe button and you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button. Otherwise, YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded and I have new ones coming almost every single day so as always stay fit stay energetic and go and get those gains peace